This is a short video on the CM1A MIDI to CV converter. And the main thing that we're focusing on today is configuring it to change between monophonic and duophonic modes. So let's take a closer look at the module itself. There's a USB input, a DIN MIDI input, a MIDI through, two control voltage outputs, two trigger outputs. So this module can be configured to be either monophonic with the same control voltage coming from both outputs, or it could be configured in duophonic mode, which would output two voltages corresponding to the lowest and highest keys played on the keyboard. So the first thing I'm going to do is cut off the power. I've already removed the screws. And you see there are two LEDs and a button. We're going to cut the power back on. The left LED indicates whether or not the control voltage output will be appropriate for the system 55 or 35 or 15, in which case it'll be red, or the CV will be appropriate for the system 100 or the 2500 series, in which case it would be green. So I can do a quick press to this button and it toggles between green and red. So we're using the system 55, we'll leave it on green. The right LED indicates whether or not the control voltage outputs will be operating in monophonic or duophonic mode. A long press will toggle the right LED. Red indicates that it's monophonic. Green indicates that it's duophonic. So that's the configuration of those two parameters. And again, we'll cut the power off so that we don't short out the circuitry as we're reinstalling it back into the cabinet. One other quick note, this button here controls whether or not these triggers are V triggers, which would be all the way on the left side, or S triggers all the way on the right side. In the center position, you would have both, which would mean the upper one would be S trigger and the bottom one would be V trigger or vice versa. So we're going to demonstrate the duophonic mode. And the first case is when you press a single note and you can hear two oscillators phasing with each other. Uh, the second use case is playing a low note and a high note. This duophonic mode allows you to play harmonies. The one thing that I want to point out is that there is a limitation to this, and that is you can't separately articulate the low note and the high note. And what I mean by that is if you press a note and hold it, when you play the upper notes, it's not going to re-trigger the envelope. If you play just single notes and have staccato articulation, you can hear the slow flute-like attack. If you play two notes, one of which is held, you don't get that slower attack, all you get is a change in the pitch that's immediate and not a re-articulation of the slower attack. That is the CM1A MIDI to CV converter 
in duophonic mode, and I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.